Hello everyone, welcome back to Education Monday. This is the second video of our four part series covering previous year's SSLC ex science exam questions with answers. In this video, we will focus on three marks questions. As before, if you notice any missing questions, it means they were not part of syllabus. So let's get started. Physics three marks questions with answers. First question here. Draw the ray diagram of image formation when the object is kept at 2f1 of the convex lens. With the help of ray diagram, mention the position and the nature of the image formed. f1, principal focus of the lens. Here the diagram is given and the position of the image is at 2f2 and the nature of the image is real and inverted. Let's go to next question. 200 joule of heat is produced each second in a 8 ohm resistance. Find the potential difference across the resistor. Here heat is 200 joule, resistance is 8 ohm, time is 1 second and we potential difference is what we need to find. So the formula for heat is H is equals to I square RT and if we need to find I's, we, we will send R and T at that side and we will get this formula. When you substitute the given and solve we will get i is equals to 5 ampere thus the potential difference across the resistor v is equals to ir this is ohm's law and v i is 5 ampere and r is 8 ohm so with the v is 40 volt there is an optional question an electric refrigerator rated 300 watt operates 6 hours in a day what is the cost of energy to operate it for 30 days at rupees 7 per kilowatt hour solution Total energy consumed by the refrigerator in 30 days would be 300 watt and the time 3 6 hours per day and a total of 30 days. So the total will be 54,000 watt hour. We can write it as 54 kilowatt hour. Thus the cost of energy to operate the refrigerator for 30 days is 54 kilowatt hour for 7 rupees per kilowatt hour and it will be a total of 378 rupees. Next question. In domestic circuits, one what are the reasons for overloading and to explain the working of earth wire the reasons for overloading are when the live wire and neutral wire comes into direct contact leakage of the current in electric appliances happens and connecting too many appliances to a single socket these are the reasons for overload and working of earth wire is the metallic body of electric appliances are connected to the earth wire if any leakage of current occurs in the electric appliances keeping their potential difference same as to that of earth and user may not get severe electric shock next question a concave lens has focal length of 25 centimeter at what distance should the object from the lens be placed so that it forms an image at 20 centimeter from the lens find the magnification of image produced in the lens answer the given v which represents the distance of the image from the lens and f which means focal length of the lens and u means distance of the object from the lens and the formula of the lens is 1 by v is minus 1 by u is equals to 1 by f since we need to find u we are converting lens formula into this formula and substitute the given then we will get u is equals to minus 100 centimeter but the thing we need to find is magnification magnification m is equals to v by u v is minus 20 and u is minus 100 and when we solve this we will get 1 by 5 which is m is equals to plus 0 0.2 next question draw the ray diagrams that show near point of the hypermetropic eye hypermetropic eye correction for hypermetropic eye this is the first diagram which shows near point of hypermetropic eye this shows hypermetropic eye and this one shows correction for hypermetropic eye next question mention the function of digester present in a biogas plant and mention four properties to support that the biogas is an excellent fuel answer functions of di digester present in biogas plant anaerobic microorganisms here decompose the complex compounds of cow dung slurry the decomposition process here uh, completes and generates biogas and reasons for excellent fuel are biogas contains up to 75 percent of methane it burns without smoke and leaves no residue its heating capacity is very high it is also used for lightning the slurry left behind is used as excellent manure 
the large scale utilization of bio waste sewage and materials provide a safe and efficient method of waste disposal next question a concave lens has focal length of 30 cm at what distance should the object from the lens place it so that it forms an image at 20 cm from the lens so this question is the same as we have solved before v is minus 20 f is minus 30 and you need to find v u and when you solve this you will get u as minus 60 the, thus the object distance is 60 centimeter this there is an optional question find the focal length of convex mirror whose radius of curvature is 6 centimeter and find the power of convex lens of focal length 0.2 meter let's go to answer here radius of curvature is plus 6 centimeter for convex mirror and f focal length you need to find formula is f is equal to r by 2 6 by 2 which is 3 centimeter and as for second focal length is given as for convex lens 0.2 meter and you need to find power power formula is 1 by f and 1 by 0 0.2 which is plus 5 d question draw the diagram for the image formation in a convex lens when the object is placed between 2 f1 and f1 mention the position and the nature of the image formed f1 principal focus of lens here is the diagram and the nature of the image is real and inverted and the position of the image is beyond f2 next question what are the characteristics of a good score of energy write any two uses of solar cells characteristics of a good source of energy would be one which would do a large amount of work per unit volume or mass be easily accessible be easy to store and transport and must be economical uses of solar cells they are used in artificial satellites and space probes and radio or wireless transmissions or tv relay stations in traffic signals calculators toys street lights vehicles and watches next chemistry three marks questions with answers identify the substances that are oxidized and reduced in the following chemical reaction zno plus c gives zn plus co here zno is reduced and c is oxidized next what is rancidity mention any two methods to prevent rancidity when fats and oils are oxidized they become rancid and their smell and taste changes Substances which prevents oxidation ox antioxidants are added to food, keeping food in airtight containers. Next question. Give below incomplete equation represents a chemical process of converting an unsaturated carbon compounds to saturated carbon compounds. Here they have given C2H4 and you need to find Y and X. First complete the equation. Next name the gas X and the substance Y. What happens in the end products of this reaction reacts with chlorine in the presence of sunlight. Now C2H4 becomes C2H6 and H is hydrogen, Y is nickel and R palladium. When it reacts with chlorine it undergoes substitution reaction and chlorine replaces hydrogen one by one. Next, carbon could not form C4 plus or C4 minus ions Y. Write the electron dot structure of methane. Carbon could not form C minus 4 by gaining 4 electrons because it is difficult for the nucleus with 6 protons to hold on to 10 electrons. It could not form C4 plus by losing 4 electrons because it requires a large amount of energy to remove 4 electrons. And this is the dot structure of C4 methane, CH4 methane. Next. How miscellaneous are formed during cleansing action of soap? And which are the salts responsible for hardness of water? Detergents are effective even in hard water. Why? Miscellaneous are formed by the interaction of ionic end of the soap with the water while the carbon chair with the oil. Calcium and magnesium salts detergents do not form insoluble precipitation with the calcium and magnesium ions in the wa hard water. Next question. What is the chemical formula of bleaching powder? Write any two uses of this salt. Bleaching powder CaOCl2 uses are it is used as bleaching powder in paper, 
cloth and laundry industries used as oxidizing agent in chemical industries and as disinfectant next name the acid present in the following substances curd and gastric juice in curd you can find lactic acid and in gastric juice you will find hydrochloric acid hcl if the molecular formula of first member of a homologous series is c2h2 then write the names and the molecular formula of the next two members of the same series c3h3 propyne c4h6 butane b general vegetable oils are subjected to hydrogenation why to increase the shelf life of vegetable oils to prevent oxidation of oils and to prevent rancidity next question what are ionic compounds write any four properties of ionic compounds answer the compounds formed by the transfer of electrons from a metal to a non metal the properties are physical nature solid and hard melting points and boiling points are high it is soluble in water conduct electricity in molten state optional question is water alloys write any four physical properties of metals homogeneous mixture of two or more metals or a metal and a non metal are alloys physical properties are they are hard luster surface ductility malleability they are good conductors of heat good conductors of electricity and they are sonorous next question solutions a b c and d are having ph values of 2 6 8 and 13 respectively then which solution has more h plus and which solution has more oh minus ions concentration and why so solution a has more h plus ions concentration reason is if ph value is less then h plus concentration is more and solution d has more oh minus ions concentration and reason is as the ph value increases from 7 to 14 there is an increase of oh minus ions concentration next b which solution can be made to react each other to get neutral salts solution a and d and solution b and c biology 3 marks questions with answers measures of recharging underground water are better than the storage of water on the surface levels of the ground how explain answer water does not evaporate instead spreads out to recharge wells and provides moisture for vegetation and it does not provide breeding grounds for mosquitoes like stagnant water collected in ponds or artificial lakes and it does not contaminated by humans or animals waste next question in human reproduction the placenta performs a significant role in the development of a fetus into a child justify this statement it provides a large surface area to transport oxygen and glucose from mother to embryo it removes waste substances produced by developing embryo by transferring them into mother's blood and second question b how can dna copying be decided as one of the ways of reproduction in lower organisms by two genetically identical daughter cells are produced by the division of nucleus what product is formed in the first step that takes place in the cytoplasm during the respiration in animals write any two difference between aerobic and anaerobic respiration glucose is six carbon molecule breaks down into three carbon molecule pyruvate and the difference between aerobic and anaerobic respiration first let's talk about aerobic aerobic respiration takes place in the presence of oxygen energy released is more and produce carbon dioxide water and energy as for anaerobic respiration it takes place in the absence of oxygen energy is released less produce ethanol carbon dioxide and energy optional question in what form the waste products are stored in old xylem of plants how do the products of photosynthesis transports to all parts of the plant waste products are stored as resins and gums in old xylem of the plants and as for b materials like sucrose is transferred into phloem tissue using energy from atp then osmotic pressure of tissues increases and water move inside this pressure moves the material in the phloem to tissues which have less pressure next question how does touch me not plant respond to touch explain and mention any one function of 
each of auxins and abscisic acid hormones. The parts of plants that are being touched use electrochemical impulses for a movement. For this movement, plant cells changes their shape by changing the amount of water in them. As a result of this change, plant cells either swell or shrink and therefore change the shape of the leaves. As for auxins, increase the elongation in the tip of the stems and abscisic acid inhibits the growth of plants. Optional question, how muscle cells respond to a nerve impulse and mention the function of each of insulin and estrogen hormones in humans. Muscle cells receive nerve impulse from neurons. Muscle cells convert received electrical impulses into chemical signals. Then the special proteins in the muscle cells change their shape and arrangement. And due to this new arrangement of proteins, the muscle cells either elongate or become short. Insulin controls the sugar level in blood and estrogen promotes the development of sex organs in females, regulates menstruation cycle. Next question. Draw the diagram showing the structures of longitudinal section of human brain and label the following parts. One cerebrum and, and second is medulla. Here is the diagram. I think you have all practiced this. This is cerebrum and this is medulla. Next question. Red flower RR 4 o'clock plant is crossed with white flowering WW 4 o'clock plant. There are 25% red flowering and 25% white flowering and 50% hybrids are obtained in F2 generation. Then, what are the characteristics of plant of F1 generation and show the results of F2 generation with the help of a checkerboard and mention the genotypic ratio and determine the trait that can be considered either as dominant or recessive by analyzing the results of both F1 and F2 generations. In F1 generation, all are hybrids because RR and WW gives RW means which are all are hybrids. This is checkerboard for F2 generation. Gametes are W and RW which we got from F1 generation and it gives one pure RR and one pure WW and a hybrid of RW. So the genotypic ratio is 1 is to 2 is to 1. And for the third question, the answer is in F1 generation, 100% hybrids are found and in F2 generations, 50% because as you can see here, these two are pure and this is hybrid. So that neither red color nor white color is dominant or recessive. That's the conclusion. Next question. How are the process of reproduction in Hydra and Planaria different from each other? Explain. Hydra reproduction is by budding. A bud develops as an outgrowth due to the repeated cell division at one specific site. The bud develops into an independent individual. And as for planaria, reproduction is by generation. Specialized cells proliferate and make large number of cells. Different cells undergo changes to become various tissues or development. Many pieces of planaria grow into separate individuals. Next question means optional question. How does a fertilized egg in the uterus develop into an embryo? How does this embryo get nourishment in the mother's womb? Explain. The fertilized egg zygote starts dividing in and forms an embryo. The embryo is implanted in the lining of uterus. It continues to grow and develop organs to become fetus. And as for nourishment, with the help of a special disc shaped tissue called placenta, it contains villi on the embryo's side and blood spaces on the mother's side. This provides glucose and oxygen to the developing embryo. Next question. Draw the diagram showing that the structure of human brain laboring cerebrum and cerebellum. As before mentioned, this is cerebrum and this is cerebellum. That's all for this video. I hope these three marks questions and answers helps you in your SLC science preparation. Stay tuned for next part. We will cover more important questions. Thank you.